by uh, Wayne White here. I'm a watercolor artist and I'm going to paint another scene for you today. Heading outside on the, my deck. Um, and I've got a picture that I took in Ireland. Can you see, see, see this? This is a scene of, uh, an Irish scene of a few, uh, presumably fishing boats on the side of a, of a stone wall. But I, I don't want to show all of that. So what I've done, I, I've cut a, I, I cut a rectangle out of an old envelope. I'm going to show this part of it. Take that boat out, and I'm going to put this little rowboat in the back, in the back of that. And this telephone pole, I'm going to move over here. It's in, it's in my way. So that's my scene. I've already wetted the back of my paper, and now I'm going to wet the front. And this is going to keep the paper from uh, buckling. I've already done my drawing in light pencil. Plain gray is kind of dull. So I'm going to mix up blue and I'm going to add a little bit of burnt sienna to it to gray it down. So now I'll paint in the sky. This is kind of a busy scene, so. I don't want the sky to be busy, so I'm not going to put in any clouds. And there aren't there, there aren't clouds there anyway. And put it down in the water. So I'm painting around the boats. And following my pencil guidelines. Flushing it now while the paint's dry. You'll notice I'm using a big brush. around the boats. Well, the first coat is about the same as the water, really. A little bit of raw sienna. And drop it in here and there. Kind of suggests the color of the stone wall. It's kind of gray and gray and browns, burnt sienna here and there. The wall color has come down to the water. That's all right. I'll just just blend it in. Now I'll come back and and, and repeat the. Uh, Reflection in the water. I'm going to take some yellow and I'm going to mix it, mix the yellow up with the paint's gray. With the lighter and warmer green in the foregrounds, the trees in the foreground. I can wait and do that at the end. bit of a breeze coming in here. Okay, now, <clears throat> there's, a, there's the uh, foreground trees. I still have to put in the grass. There's a grass strip growing right there. That in later. Now I want to go back. And get the, the, the green way back there. Oh, 
on the background green. That's the hillside back there. I'm pushing that in the back. You see, I've got the blue green back there, yellow green foreground. As, as your eye goes back in the background, it gets bluer. Got, I've got to get the middle green in here, and I've got to get a grassy green. I'm, I'm going to have to make this a pretty yellowish green along here. In with some green. I get a nice grassy green. Right in here. Let's see. I think now to the water. Mix up Payne's gray. Now in the, the middle ground. I don't always know what my brush is doing. So I guess sometimes I think it has a mind of its own. I think I'll go to the house right now. Yeah. First of all, I'm going to do the shadow side of the house. Bright red, 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 maybe a maybe a burnt sienna. There's a burnt sienna, and I'll, I'll add some, some red to it. with the light. Yellow through that make that kind of orangey at the top when the sun hits. Like I said, I'm just going to suggest the stones because I can't paint, no, no reason to paint all those stones in there. So well, underneath the stones, each row of stones will be a shadow underneath. So for the shadow, I'm going to take some burnt umber and some Payne's gray. And Before I've added uh, the windows, but put in the suggestion of the windows, the chimneys, um, 
the shadow on the house, the shadows on the boats, the windows on the boats. Worked a little more on the water, the reflections in the water. I'm doing the telephone pole up there. I'm just trying to soften that, the shadow on the telephone pole. Faint line like the telephone line. You don't have to try to paint that. You just take your pencil, need. That's it. Very simple. I just have to clean up around the chimney. That's kind of rough around there. I clean that up. Yeah, I think I'm pretty much finished. What do you think? I'm about finished. I got a few touch-ups to do, but I'll do that in, in the studio later on. But anyway, this is my uh, boat scene in Ireland. I really don't quite remember where that was, but I took the picture and I simplified it because there were more boats here and I moved the telephone pole. So there you have it. So hope you come again.